Center field. Oduble comes on, makes the catch as he comes forward. And the inning is over. So Floramone gets the fills through this eighth inning. He did allow a couple runs in the home run, but we go to the ninth. It's 15 2. Braves on top. Lestella in the left. Braun is on the run, and he's got it. Perez with one pitch gets the final out. Daniel Robertson, the Rays infielder, will open the bottom of the eighth inning. So two up and two down. Fly ball into left. Span on the track and a perfect inning here in the eighth inning for Daniel Robertson. One, two, three, a very efficient inning for the Rays infielder. Not listed under the pitchers is that young man right there, Brian Holiday. And it's Reese Hoskins nonetheless. Who oh, fans at that 62 <laughs> mile an hour offering, and he wants the ball. That's right, he should want the ball. <laughs> Held on to by Freitas and Taylor Motter has his first big league strikeout. What do you think, Aaron? Elevated fastball, top of the strike zone. That's the scanner report, says Blow. Change, change the eye level. Strike three call. And how about Cliff Pennington? Strikeout to end the inning. Ground ball up the middle. Right there is Dozier. And that'll do it. We have an interesting turn of events. Pablo Sandoval is going to pitch. Slowly hit. Tomlinson to belt. And three ground balls in Sandoval. Gets the Dodgers one, two, three for the first time in this game here in the night. Can Descalso get that first career K? He got him! Still perfect, Daniel Descalso. Sky to right. Snyder will make the catch, and it's a scoreless eighth inning for field. Dirt all over his uniforms. Usually the best player on the field is your shortstop and your pitcher, and he throws a 1 2 3 inning. To get the fills out of the bottom of the eighth inning. Kendrys Morales, that's right, he's on the mound in the same game. And another fly ball to the center. Granderson going back in the shadows and he makes the catch. Morales has a pretty good inning. He walked a batter but gets three outs. And the crowd here at Rogers Center enjoyed it. Terrific guy. This one back to the mound. Spansberg trying to start two. Look out. Pirelli gets one on the first double play. A couple guys went to cover at second base, so Spansberg just fired it in that direction. And he chops it to the right side. Not bad. Not bad, Jed Jerko. The left center shallow. Simmons gets back there, says he's got it, and he does. So all in all, a nine pitch inning for Smolinski. And Perez strikes out. Just couldn't time the 80 mile an hour pitch. Kept go. Digs one out, pops it to center. How about that? Brandon Geyer said nothing to this pitching thing. One, two, three in his first ever pitching appearance as a pro. Popped up, foul ground. Hosmer will drift into foul ground by the first base coach's box and make the catch. So two runs allowed of the ninth by Spangenberg, 12-1 Oakland. Infielders will go on the mound and, and you'll watch him and they'll actually try to air it out. But Garcia, to his credit, just Oh, BP fastball. How about a double play? He gets it. 5 4 3. 5 0 Arizona in the fifth after a long rain delay. And Barnhart out on strikes. How about that? Jimenez kept throwing the ball 69 miles an hour, 69 miles an hour. And then that last pitch, he gasses up to 84 and throws it right by Barnhart. Trotting in from the bullpen. Yes. It is just when you thought it was safe. Matt Davidson comes on to pitch. There it was, strike three. Denton True Davidson 
takes us to the night. He's just trying to get through this without getting hurt. There is the knuckleball. Called strike three. All right. That was worth it. A backwards K on a 59 mile an hour knuckleball. Yep. Jesus Sucre is going to be out there to try to protect this five run lead. Fly ball, left center field. Kiermaier on the run is going to leap and make the catch. The tag at third. Brenson will score. It's 9 5 now. And here comes Cash out. And that's going to be it for Sucre. Inning finally comes to an end as Bradley once again lines out to his teammate at the University of South Carolina with Merrifield. Reynolds here, 2 0 count, comes set. Will Squibber off the end, forgot to cover first. <laughs> Get over there. And I always thought as a hitter it was tough hitting off those guys, but good follow through. He held the pose for about 10 seconds after the pitch. <laughs> Here's a reaction from Zimmerman Scherzer and then coming off the field. He went over to Matt Adams said my bad. I got to get over there. Osmer got under it. To tell Marte. LeMayhew has been a real problem. Gets him to pop up. Carries out to center for Pollock. He would pull it foul into the bleachers in right field. Then you could go to work. You're ahead 0 and 1. Left center. Owings and Peralta collide. CO hangs on. John Jay in right field. He punches one out to Jay in right. Yetsi's getting a hit here on Monte. This could be a four pitch inning. It will be. Avila on a roll. Look who's on the mound. Alex Blandino. And he's going to retire lean door. Sixty seven and a strikeout of Brandon Geyer. I think that was a knuckleball. This comes a knuckler again I think. No nope, that's fastball. Ooh. Look out. Eric Gonzalez says not me big boy. Went around and got the strikeout. So he strikes out two batters, gives up one hit and no runs. Good position player out there. Let Andrew Romine do something he did last year, last uh, game of the season with Detroit. Get him on the mound. Demo will yield to Heredia for the catch. He's tied Ken Griffey Jr. for sixth place all time at 6.30. Oh, what a great by team. Nice short hop. Nice play. 2-2. Two, two. Seager throws him out. Ah, oh, curveball. Come to pop up. And Astadio comes off the mound with an ERA of 45. Tommy Lestella to Yadier Molina and deep to center field is Almora. He leaps and makes the grab up against the vines. Hard on the ground, but a chance for two. And they turn it. You know, when Tommy needs to dial up the ground ball, that's what he's good at. Yeah, he turns it over a little bit. Fowler in the air to right. Hap's got it. Well, he, he looks like he's, uh, he recoils a little bit. He's got a nice, easy delivery. Ground ball knocked down. Kick save by Caratini, and he'll get Bowman at first. A rarity indeed. Caratini over to Thank cover you. the bag. All right. Pena's out. Garcia homered off La Stella. I'm just going to say, has anyone ever homered off two different position players in the same game? Ian Happ. Pitcher number seven for the Cubs today. Jerko pops it up. Baez will grab it. That would not feel too good. Baez throws out Colton Wong. And he's going to get Fowler. 
Dexter 0 for 2 against position players. Round for that injury this year for Suter in the last two weeks. Bellinger in the left. And there to make the catch is Phillips. Kemp in the left. And Phillips is there for out number two. Yep. Bouncing ball to short, long throw. Got him. You don't want to be in this. Oh, got a chance for two. Fire to second, Miller to first. Come on now. Eric Kratz starts the double play. I feel that baseball is so regional. It's a popular sport. So you've got to be really mindful of the potential for something to come screaming back at you. Baez, Russell, the Rizzo. So David Peralta used to be a pitcher. Hit that ball hard, but into a double play. Fly ball to center. Rizzo's ERA zero. Miscommunication. And this ball well struck out to left field. Calhoun though is there, and the inning is done. He's got any more? Ground ball, third base. Playable for Tanner Falefa. One, two, three for Ryan Ruhl. Williams swings at the first pitch and in right center it is Bellinger to flag it down and snow cone it for the first down. With a smile on his face. DK trying to hold one back. You forgot the efficient part in your scouting report. And that pitch is inside. So another walk. So four walks in the inning and uh, Kevin Cash comes out and had four walks a balk one fly ball to center. That's going to be it for Gomez. Scope pops it up. Bowers coming in from first makes the catch to retire the side one and two on the ground at shortstop Matt Davidson. Machine. Bottom of the eighth, and look who's on the mound. Jose Reyes was ready to pitch <laughs> for the first time in his professional career. Ryan Zimmerman was not ready for him to pitch, and we already have controversy. A fastball at 80 miles an hour in for a strike, and wasting no time. And Zimmerman lifts one out to right center. Back in the gap goes Jackson with Nimmo, and Nimmo makes the catch on the warning track. 0 2 to Soto. And he punches that one down the left field line. Conforto gets over to grab it. Oh. And the inning finally comes to an end. Jose Reyes's professional pitching debut. Six runs in an inning of work. Strike three call the borderline <laughs> pitch. <laughs> and they oh, love it. Look at Valencia strut off the mound. He's trying not to smile. Is a called third strike at 73 miles per hour. Out number one, finally, after the first five reaching. And a bouncing ball that's snapped up by Orlando Arcia. Kratz has a one, two, three, eighth inning. Backhanded by Forsyth, and he ends the inning. And everybody seems to be no worse for the wear. One and two. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Davidson guns down Stanton two away. That was a good curveball in the meantime. Not for a position player. This is just a good curveball for anybody. With Jackson sitting out at second. Miserocco bounces one down to third. Tricky hop. But taken care of by Suarez. And they'll get the out at first. Barnhart at first. With a good backhand. So Philip Irvin gets the Reds out of trouble here in the eighth. Hold the third. Let's try this again. Backhanded across the diamond. And that'll do it for Francisco RC in his major league debut as a pitcher. And the new pitcher, how about this? Brandon Dixon on the mound. Don't hurt yourself. Can you there. believe that? That was a curveball. Brandon Dixon doing it. Look at this. Coming with a hook. 
to get the best player in the American League. They want to see what they have in him. Can't really call him a prospect anymore. And that's Corey, or excuse me, Jeff Quint, or McNeil grounding out to second as a pinch hitter for Corey Oswald. And that'll sit down the side. For Franco, he'll go to second. Arenado lines two Albies, who handles on a short hop. Way to go, Charlie. Great job. Yeah, he gave up a run, but who cares? Ten pitch inning. He's efficient. Popped it up. New right fielder is Heredia Cano going back, calling everybody off. One out. Square to the plate. Remember where you were. Slater, side retired. Darno gets the job done. Jammed him. Cano puts it away. Round of three. Well, Turner goes deep with a couple of men on base. Mariners are down to their final three outs. Just pitch, act like they were pitchers. Shepler runs it down. Starting to get loose. <laughs> and that ends it on a kind of a comical note. Yeah. Dan Straley's glove. Holiday working quickly. And gets Anderson to ground out. Oh, the front office didn't write the script to Moneyball. That went on the ground, little shovel. And Coward turns it. And how about Arcio? Much better at that inning. I think you maybe have one or more choices in there. Finally, you get in. On the strikeout for Peterson. He has knocked in five runs. Pitch hit in the air to right. Judge going back to make the catch to end the inning.